Okay? Keep that window open and just yell at me if you need me. Oh, you're here.
I don't need to see if they hate it. Huh. Hey guys, go. Go. Name. Go. Uh, Nadi Aho. <laughs> you cannot say that. What? Nadia Aho. Nadia Aho. Play that back in your head. No, Nadia. you can't say that. Nadia Aho. Nadia Aho. Nadia Aho. You want to call Nadia Aho? How about Aho? Aho, okay. Nadia Aho. Ashley okay. Reader. Where are you adding letters? Brand. Brand. Okay. Sophia said it. Charlie. Okay.
Wexler Juniors. Coached by Eric Ebay and Thomas Wadowski. And welcome to the second game of the day for JTV's Game of the Sports, uh, Game of the Week, my apology. And I'm Steve Ifantis, and we have the Power Puff 2020 Bowl today. The seniors versus juniors in a girl versus girl flag football game. I am ready for some action today. Right now, I believe that is the juniors that are being announced right now. The juniors they are announcing right now. As here we go. Rebecca Lewis. Number 55. Mega Madrevsky. Number 13. Brooke McCown. Number 20. Marla Momperuz. Number 7. Kayla Moyer. Number 21. Noel Powers. Number 19. Victoria Hangelo. And if you're just tuning in, this is DJTV's Game of the Week of the, t of the second game today, the Power Puff Bowl. Seniors versus juniors, girl versus girl in a flag football. Now I believe we're starting the seniors, I believe. All right, and now introducing our senior players. First we have... Number 15, Nadio Ajo. Number 18... Ashley Bram, number 29, Sophia Sender, number 17, Charlie Kachowski, number 21, Madison Faulkner, number 10, Sky Jorgensen, number 23, Krista Loro, number 4, Maria Mofferus, number 2, Shayla Nagel, number 22, Gina, uh, Gina Novello, number 6, Lorna Leary, number 8, Hannah Reese, Number 24, Julia Rodriguez. Number 11, Melanie Figueroa. And number 16, Kathleen Sennett. All right, we're going to try it one more time. If you could please uh, stand for the national anthem and please remove your hat. <laughs> Welcome to the 2021 Power Puff. And if you do not know the rules of flag right, football, like the gonna, flag uh, football is. Memorial High School's production of The Addams Family. You can get those tickets at jmhstheater.booktix.com. Thank you very much. Yeah. 
And if you guys do not know the rules of flag football, the rules, it's just basically regular football, but no tackling. You take the flag down, and that just simulates a tackle. And so, here we go. Coin toss right now. There are, f I believe, four quarters, 20 minutes, I believe. That's what I believe flag football is. It's just like regular football, so. Hitting with some drone action again with Mr. Noble on the drone today. Just waiting for them to take the field. And here they go, they are taking the field. Are we doing a kickoff or are we just playing the ball at the 20 and just calling it a day? So, let's see what we're doing. Okay, it looks like we're getting started in their starting positions. Alrighty. We're just going to be starting right now. Oh, they're actually just going to do football moves here. Oh, we're actually going to do a punt? Nope, we're going to snap the ball to the quarterback, and the quarterback's got the ball. Number 20. And she's going to go. She's keep going for it, and she's going to eventually go out of bounds. That is number 13 for the juniors as their starting quarterback. Brooke McCown as their starting the quarterback, and she just gained a 15-yard gain there, I would pretty much say. And in football, it is a running clock for most of the game. As now, here we go again. The ball will be spotted. Uh, did they gain enough for Yes. I don't, did they gain enough for Oh, we're going to take another. Ooh. Okay. Here we go. The ball is now, I believe. Oh, we're taking a look at the replay. And here we go. She, you see. As now. Brooke has the ball, she snaps it, and oh, just broken up by the defense there. That was a cont contested catch, but well done by both teams. But we're going to take another look at that. Here we go. As you see here, Brooke's got the ball, she goes up, and oh, what a play by the defense there. Really in flag football, it's just, you, it's just one rushing the quarterback, and then everyone else is just running down deep for a pass. And 48's got it, and she stays in bounds. And then she goes, she steps out of bounds. All right, bounce back. Steps out of bounds before she took the flag. That is number 48. And we're gonna take a look at the replay. As you see, Brooke passes it to... I do not have... Let's Catherine. go, get some flags. And she stepped out of bounds first, and now we have a first down, so the chains are moved. Here we go. As you see now that the June. Oh, what are we doing here? Okay, let's see. I guess. Oh, they're helping fixing the flag. Now. And now the juniors are getting ready to score a touchdown, in my opinion. And she's she's going to throw deep. It's intercepted. And number eight's got it for the seniors. And she's going. And I think she's gone. <laughs> That's gonna be a pick six on the third play of the game. Number eight got the interception there. Who is that? That's Hannah Reese. If you don't remember her, she was just in the cross game today. That's, that is a pick six. Well done, Hannah, well done. Do we have a replay of that? I would like to see that if we do. All right, let's see this again. As Brooke here goes up for a slight throw and Hannah just gets lucky there. Uh, she just was in the right place at the right time there, and she just 
took it all the way to the house. Brooke could not stop her. She didn't have enough speed. Hannah was just way faster. As now they're going to be lining up. Oh, no extra point. I guess they're just going to place the ball at the 20. I guess that's what they're happening. Nope. Oh, they're going to line up for the extra point, I think. I think they are kicking an extra point here. Who's kicking it? I would like to know that, please. Anybody know? So, okay. Oh, we're actually doing an extra point. Oh, wow. And the ball will be placed at the five yard line here. 6 10 remaining, and we got a pick six here. And oh, what a. They're going for two, I think. They're going for two points, and it's a reverse. Does she get it? She does. Number 23 gets the two point conversion. That's Christy Loro here. That's a two point conversion. We're going to take another look at this. As you see here, hands it off, but no, it's actually a reverse to number 23, which gets it in. And she gets in, but number she pulls her flags two seconds too late. As now, it's just a running clock in flag football. So now, we're going to be lining the ball up back at the 20. So the juniors can take back over and the seniors had a dominating defense last time. Maybe the juniors have to change something on offense here. I would pretty much say as now. Oh. So here we go again. And we hear we got some boy cheerleaders died trying to pump up the crowd. That's some funny stuff. <laughs> As now we're going to see the drone shot of everything overhead. And now here comes the snap. It's a fake handoff and Brooks going to keep. No, it's actually reverse. And she's sit. Oh, she stumbled and her flags come out too. That looks to be. I can't see the number. 19? 19 for the juniors. That is number 19, Victoria. Don't worry about the pass. They're not passing Thank you. it. Victoria Pungalo. Here we go. Melody, they're Run running up. the ball. Press up. Press up. All righty, and Melody, we're back. Up, we're so now, ball. here we go. The juniors are at, looks they're like to be the 40. Oh, and, oh, they're doing some cartwheel action. Oh, she's wide open. Oh, my God. And 72 just walks out of bounds. Whoa, I would like to see that play again. We got cartwheels going, and we got a player wide open. What? What just happened? Brooke. Got a wide open here. Let's see. We got cartwheels and the defense was just didn't know what to do. And then 73 got 72 got wide open. Is that 72? 72 got wide open there. That is who 72? 72, 72. I do not have a number for 72. So I do oh yes, I do. Abigail Stanberry. And now Brooke McCain here is gonna take it in for the touchdown! And the uh, juniors have now scored six points. Wondering if they will go for two here. I would. Do they go for two for a tie, or do they just take the extra point? And we're going to see that. And just Brooke just keeps it. She completely tricks the defense and just keeps it for herself. And it looks like they're going to go for two here. So to tie the ball game up. Here we go. You, you hear, hear the boys. You hear some cheerleaders, and you can also see some boy cheerleaders on the side. They're gonna run it. No, Brooks gonna keep it. She can still throw if she wants. She gets in for the two. No good. No, they pulled their flag in time. Nope, they pulled the flag, and we got some trash talking by number 23 there, Christy Loro. As you see here, Brooke does does not cross the line right there. Got it before she crossed the line. So two points do not count. It's only 8-6 still. And now the seniors watch you be their first time on offense this game. And they're up 2 nothing here. So I would like to see how the seniors would play on offense. We haven't seen it yet. We only had a pick six here. And here we go. And now where are those boy cheerleaders at? 
Are they for seniors? No, there's no boy cheerleaders on the senior side. Is there any for the, there's a bunch of the juniors. There they are right there. And they're doing some push-ups right now. Why are the boy cheerleaders doing push-ups? As now, they're sending their offensive union out and their quarterback that will lead, hopefully, them to victory for the seniors is number two, Shaylin Nagel here. All right, let's yes, here we go. And now the seniors are the first time on offense here. Excuse me. It's not easy, Coach. No, that's how. Yes, here we go. And it's going to be a handoff to number eight. Number eight cuts back to the inside. She keeps going. She keeps going. And no, oh, she misses the flag. She stays inside, spins, and pushed out of bounds, but blows both flags out before she stepped out of bounds. And now you can hear those juniors just pumped up by that by that run, even though that was against them, so I don't know why they would be so pumped up. As now, it's still 8-6. We're going to take another look at that. Um, see here, oh, okay. We have to move over a little bit. All right, there it is. You see it's a handoff to the right. She cuts back to the left, and she keeps going, she keeps going, she keeps going, and then she thought she was going to get tackled, and she jukes right here, and she was like, oh, I got it, and then they're okay. Oh, we got another quarterback. She throws in number 17, and her flag is pulled out. Number, 17. number six threw the ball there for them. That is Lauren O'Reary. O o so, yeah. It is now the seniors are looking to make some points, and I believe they called a timeout here. Or no, they're just in the huddle. Here we go. We're going to be in the huddle now. Discussing their play call for the offense here. Just those ladies and gentlemen for turning in, turning it, tuning in now. This is the Powder Puff Bowl girl action football, flag football, seniors versus juniors of Memorial. And now it's pass, it's gonna be there. And she's gonna go up the middle. No, she's actually gonna go to the left and they're gonna actually lose yards on that play. That actually hurt the seniors there. They actually lose a couple yards. And now Marla is just holding that ball, holding that foot, holding that flag like I got it. I saved us guys. I saved the touchdown for us. As we're gonna take another look. It's a pass. She inter she intercepts. Uh she doesn't intercept it. She grabs it. And now they're just like she doesn't know where to go. And then Marla just gets there for the grab right there. She grabs the flag, it's down, awesome lost a couple yards, play. and now we got a second down here. Here we go. Is it gonna be handed off? No, it's gonna be a short pass to number eight, and number eight's gonna cut back, cut back again! But she's down there, ooh! Got a little trucking after action after the play, and now it's third down here. The seniors are looking to expand this lead here. And we're gonna take another look at this. Here we go. Oop, cuts. And then cuts right back into the center, and then Marla saves the day again by taking that flag. Here we go, it's a handoff. And Marla doesn't grab it this time. She runs out of bounds, so fourth down. What will the seniors do here? Will they go for it? Or kick the extra? kick the field goal here and we're gonna take it it's a nice handoff to number 23 here and she's just gonna miss that grab she good and she was like oh I'm gonna keep going and she just steps right out of bounds there and looks like they're gonna go for it here here it is it's a pass a touchdown, a seniors! Charlie Kachowski. Number 17. As now we're going to see here, she just takes it, takes it, and 17 just got open there, and she just lost track of her man there, and it's a touchdown. Back to the drone shot by Mr. Noble. Thank you, Mr. Noble, for doing such a good job today on those drone shots. And also thank you everyone inside the bus for making both shoots run smoothly today. 
All righty. And they're going to just kick the extra point here. They, so they cannot go for the here. They're just going to kick the extra point. Here it comes. Oh, they gotta re they're got to they going to hold it. She's holding it. We're kicking the extra point. Here we go. Here she goes. Can she make it? It's good! And that is a field goal. And that's One point for the seniors. There it is. And now it's 15 to 6 with 6.30 left to go in this first half to play. First quarter, quarter of play. And boom, she kicks right through the uprights. And now the juniors will go back on offense here. The juniors need some points here. They didn't they did not get the extra point. They did not get the extra point or the two-point conversion last time. And the seniors have only been on offense twice. No. Twi no, once. And scored once. Because they got to pick six. They got to pick six the first time. So and just those for tuning in now. This is the Powder Puff Bowl of the juniors and seniors. And seniors are up 15 to six. They're up by nine points and by two scores here. As now here we go. As now the juniors get back on offense here. They're on their own 20. Their own every. The end zones and every 20 yards are marked because that's every first down marker. There's only two first downs. The f their 40 and the end zone. Oh, we got another cartwheel play. And she's going to throw it deep. Oh, just overthrown. Okay, and we're going to make some defensive subs here for the senior team. And yeah, that's how you keep your eye on the ball. Yeah. Like that, bro. Let's go. Come on, Maddie. Come on, Maddie. Come on, Stay in it. Stay in it. I told you. Yes, here we go. They might be going out of the pass play here. I could see that, but I can also see another play. They're going pass here, and no cartwheel play. Oh, it's over. It's a trick play. It's going to be to the quarterback. And now the quarterback's going to look. Oh, she gets tackled right there. As now here we go. Uh-oh. Got too many people on the field. Got too many people on the field for defense, so that's an extra 10 yards for the offense here. Right? Second down, they're gonna replay the down now. Instead of third down, they're just gonna replay it, but they're gonna replay it, but they're gonna keep the yards. So, yeah. Oh, here we go, we're gonna go deep. Oh! Oh, just a good pass break. That's a good defensive play there. It was a little dangerous to throw into that. That was double covered and nobody was there open, in my opinion. Um, if we have a replay, I'd like to see that, but uh, I don't think we do. Um, yeah. Here we go. I think we're going again. It's third down now. And if I'm the juniors here, you got to be thinking deep play here, but you got to be thinking somebody open because the last two plays haven't been to somebody open. And oh, we got her. She's got it. It's intercepted by number 11 on the seniors. That is Medley. 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 And another interception by the seniors. The juniors are just right now are just, uh oh, juniors. I don't know what to do right now. Yo, go deep! Uh, but there's plenty of football left to be played right now, so anything can happen. Football is a changing sport all the time, so anything can happen in football. It's football. And especially flag football when it's flag football. So, yeah, with 2.51 remaining in this first quarter of play, the, ju the seniors are up by nine points, 15 to six. And our time is set. 240. Mel, Mel. I apologize. 237. Just started at 230. And now the junior, the seniors, will be retaking the offense field again. And they scored on their first offensive play last drive, and they got a pick six last time. Now they've already had two interceptions on the day. Junior team, senior defense is doing fine in my book, only let up six points. And now, as here, it's going to be a run. 
Go ahead. She's got to run and she's gone. She's gone. No tackle. Uh oh. She's one on one. And all she's got to do is pull that flag. No. Is that going to be it? I think we might call a touchdown. Touchdown, seniors. Oh, I thought she stepped out of bounds there. That's not, not Hannah Reese, I don't think. Wow, this game has gone from bad to worse for the juniors right now, but it's football. Anything can happen in football. I've seen leads disappear like that in football. Look at uh, the Atlanta Falcons receiving Super Bowl 51. Yeah, so 115 remaining in this first quarter of play here. The juniors are now down by, four, by three scores. And they're going for two again. Oh, it's a wrap around the other way. And she is in for the two point conversion. And that's going to be 23 to six. Not a touchdown, two point conversion. And, and the flag. stop. Oh, we got a flag on the play. I think they're char I think they're challenging the play because you can't do that. So I don't know what the flag is. Are they gonna explain the flag? No, they're gonna decline they're gonna decline the flag and they're no, they're gonna accept the flag and they're not gonna take the two point conversion. So here we go, and it's gonna be Junior's ball at the twenty. No two point conversion. For those of you just turning in now, welcome to the girls versus seniors versus junior girl flag football game of 2021. As now the seniors here are, are back on defense again, but they are up by three scores. Here we go now, the juniors get the snap. She's going, she's thinking, she's thinking, she's thinking, she's thinking, and she's gonna simply tap it up to number 17. She's fast. Oh, she might be gone. She's got one man to beat. And she's gone for the touchdown, juniors! I love football, everyone, ladies and gentlemen. And now, the juniors get a two-point conversion here. They're only down by seven points, which would not be bad going into the second quarter after throwing two interceptions to the seniors' defense now. And so, well done. 17, who is that? Let's see, that's Kayla Fitch. Fitch, Fitch. We're going to take another look at that. Quarterback's deciding, and she just tosses it to Kayla, and Kayla beats 23, beats 15, beats number 8, beats 29. And she's got one man to beat, and that's Levin, and she just beats her to the outside, and now the juniors are going for two-point conversion here. It's going to be reversed to the other side. She doesn't take it, reach the ball over. No good. No good. Oh, I thought that looked close there. I think she got the flag out in time. Let's see that. Hang on. I want to see. I want to see if she's got it. No. Nope. And that is the end of our first half. Oh, she pulled it right there. She got it just in the nick of time, like the last time. And now we're getting a 12-minute halftime. I guess it's only two halves. Okay. It's a vacant. Alrighty, we have a 12 minute halftime here, a 10 minute halftime here, I believe. So for the juniors and seniors to regroup. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna wrap up this first half of play. We're gonna send it to a commercial and we're gonna be right back, right after these few words.
And uh, sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. We didn't know we were going to have some junior cheerleaders, and we wanted to catch this action first. As now, here we go. They're going to be they're going to be showing off what the junior boys can be doing against the junior girl cheerleaders. And here we go. I want to see this. This looks great. I want to see this. This is great. Oh, they're getting rid of the pom-poms. Yeah. Oh, uh-oh. That ain't coordinated just as like the, the girls are. Oh, he just throws it back. Are they going to throw up again? Uh oh. <laughs> this is really funny. <laughs> Oh god, they're doing the pyramid. Oh, they don't have the top. Who's the top? Oh, they fell. Congrats, boys. Congrats. All right. All right, and we're going to, I believe we're going to send it off to another commercial right now. All right, we're going to send it off to a commercial. See you back in five minutes. Be there in a couple minutes. I'll text you when I'm in the car. Bye, Mom. See you later. Don't text and drive. I know. I'm sorry. I didn't see you. You didn't stop. I know, but my girlfriend, she, she's mad at me. I, I had to text her. It's my first day of school. He's only seven. I, 
I know, but I was looking down at my phone. I, I can't stop. I'm sorry. And welcome back and hi thank you noble welcome back to the powder puff football game flag football game of 2021 seniors versus juniors and if you're just joining us right now we are now in our second half final half of the game the seniors now have the ball here as now the also the seniors are up 21 to 12 that's up by and the seniors have got it number two's got the catch and she's might be gone, no. She is gone. She might be. Oh, she, the, she couldn't grab it. Did she cross the blade? They call it a touchdown. Wow, the seniors are really digging in today. I would like to see a replay of that. Yeah, we do have a replay. Here we go. Here, oh, it's a little blurry, but it's okay. And number two grabs it right there. And number six is just a nice block. Number 19 just can't grab it. And then she misses it again. As now the seniors are deciding, do they want to go for two and rub it in or do they just want to take the extra point here? It looks like they're gonna go for two here, I would say. As now, here we go. And if you're just tuning in, welcome to the Powder Puff football game of 2021. Seniors are, are up, and this is a flag football game between girls versus girls. And we got the boy cheerleaders on the sideline here trying to cheer them up. This is a tradition that we do almost every year. And the seniors are going here we for go. the two-point conversion. They're going for two. Give the ball off to number eight, and false start. False start. False start, I believe. And now the juniors will get the ball. So false start, gates the two minute, two point play. Juniors will get ball here, as here we go. Oh wait, are they taking the field goal? Wait, my bad. They got flagged, so now they're gonna take the field goal. So they're just gonna be pushed back. So now they're gonna take the extra point here. But it is 15 yards back now, so instead of at the five, it's now at the, the 20. So I'd like to see how, how powerful these le girls' legs are. And we have Crystal Loro taking the kick. Here we go. It's good. And it's good. One point to the senior. And it's good. It is now 28-12. The juniors do still have a little time here. The game is not 
out of reach, I would say, but it's more leaning towards the seniors here. The juniors got to do something quick and quick and quick and dirty here. Something. So I should not say dirty here. Quick and easy here. They got to get a touchdown on the board very quick and get a two-point conversion. So they're only down by eight. And then you got to do something on defense here. With, you do still have, I believe, a timeout to stop the clock. The clock does not stop in flag football besides a timeout. So the juniors got to get downfield quickly and then do something on defense hey, to stop that, that means you blink. Oh, that voice cry. I, I, I didn't hear any count. Like and then here we go. Like, what? As you see, every 20 line, every 20 yards is marked. That's every first down marker. And they're going to start at the 40. Or is it at the 20? That might be the 20. I'm not sure. In the real football field, that's the 40. And they called hike. It's a run with number 17 again. Oh, she grabbed that immediately. Ah, uh, if I'm the senior here, you gotta be thinking of junior here. You gotta be just thinking, gotta get the touchdown, gotta get the touchdown. That pick six is it pick six is coming up. Coming back to haunt the juniors here as now we see a look at that replay. Just number 23 just grabbed that completely. And now Brooks got the ball. She's looking to throw deep. She does. And it's intercepted again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is getting, it's getting not good right now for the juniors. The seniors are also a little bit bigger than them. and But juniors... She's thrown into contested. She's thrown contested catches. She's throwing it into just man after man. It's double man covered. And now the seniors are just gonna run the ball because they already throw it. Doesn't matter here. The clock to keep going. First down for the seniors. Here we go. Oh, nice defensive play. As you hear those juniors and seniors both. There's a lot more juniors out there than the seniors. There's only 15 seniors and 26 juniors. So, there's a lot more juniors this year that tried out and made it and also got, the team, uh, got on the team. And now, here's the scoreboard here. It's actually second down. That's not right. It's actually second down. Here. And she's got it on the outside. Oh, she cuts back to the middle. And it's got the flag. The quarterback makes up. Uh-oh. The quarterback is now trash talk and be like, I got you. Third down now. Third down for the seniors. 20 seconds. Thank you. Thank you. 15 seconds. Make sure you get out of the field. As now, seniors go. She's going to throw it. Uh oh. Intercepted! Finally, the juniors get an interception, and she's not down. And she's gonna go. She's gonna get pushed out, and both flags taken off at the exact same time. And now the juniors have life, ladies and gentlemen. They do. As now they gotta get, like I said before, they gotta get something quick, quick and easy. Here, throw it. Maybe the, maybe do that cartwheel play again, as you're gonna see here. She just gets it. It's a little too, a little too early. A little too late there to see the interception, to be completely honest. Sorry about that. We're having some technical difficulties right now. As here we go, now we got the juniors back up now. Here, oop. Oh, it's gonna be a throw. Oh, she's got a cannon for an arm, and it's gonna be intercepted. Uh-oh. Wow. Good play on defense, bad play on offense. We have a replay of that? I don't actually see that. Nope, okay. Sorry. 
I don't think we have a replay of that. Come on, offense. Juniors. I'm a sophomore. Only less than 12 minutes remaining in this final half to play here. The seniors are up by 16. That's two touchdowns plus two point conversions and Noble. Oh, this game might be a little out of reach here if the, oh, high snap and it's gonna be across the middle and she's got it. Uh-oh, she's only got one man to beat and she's, did she tackle her? There's the tackle. Set that out of bounds, there's the tackle, there's something, I don't know what that was. I'd like to see a replay of that. All right, let's take another look at this. Here we Again. go. That's right. Let's go. Let's take another look at this. Here we go. Do that reverse. Reverse to the right side. She gets the runoff. She misses. She breaks the first tackle, and then she gets tackled by a second tackle. Now we got another first down to move the chains, and now they're going to be just talking about it in the huddle. They're down. They're up by 16 points. Probably just hit like a bad spot. Got 10 seconds on the play clock here. Uh, to snap the ball. And there goes the drill. There we go. First down, and they're going to hand it off. No, they're not. They're going to do it in reverse. Number eight's got it. She beats one tackle. She spins and beats another, and then still steps out of bounds. Why? We're going to take another look at this. Here we go. You see, it's a reverse there, and the defense doesn't know it's a reverse, and she breaks that first tackle, spins out of the second tackle, and then is tackled. So they're going to be discussing here, what should we do? I would, If I'm seniors, I just keep running the ball. The running game is working, just keep running it. The juniors do not know how to stop it, even though you're up 16. You've got... Three downs to get in the end zone. Just keep running the ball if I'm the seniors. So that's what I would be doing here. Just either running or uh, throwing to the flat and then just running. Here we go. So we're going to hand it off, like I said, out to the side. Is it in? Touchdown, seniors. And I'm not going to say this game's over, but this game looks to be over. I mean, I have been called out wrong before. But since the clock is running all the time, it's going to be pretty hard for the juniors to come back from this. Here we go. We're going to see it's a handoff here, and it's just going to be run, run, beats Marla. And uh, Sky is just trying to get there, but she just doesn't get there in time. No, that's Victoria. Sorry, Victoria tried to get there. And they're going to go for two here just to extend this lead by another eight. No good. And now they are only up by 22 points. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, 22. 22. <laughs> 22 points. And now the juniors are going to get the ball back here. All righty, now the junior's got it. She's got it to throw, and it's going to be just contested again. She, this quarterback keeps throwing it to contested. Oh, my God. Back him up, coach. Back him up. Yeah. 
the pass. Oh, just overthrown. Third down for the juniors. We're going to take another look at this play. It's just, she fakes it, throws it deep, and it's just a tiny bit overthrown for her. She's just, ooh, she's just, come on. As there's the beautiful sunset off in the yonder. As now, quarterback's going to throw it again. It's a flat, oh, fumble. Oh, drop, just a drop. We're taking another look at this. Now it is third down here. It's just she she goes she goes she goes to the flat, and I believe that she wasn't just ready for the catch. She caught it. Wait, that's a fumble. That is technically a fumble in football rules. She did take two steps. That's actually a fumble. As now here we go. It's going to be a handoff. Oh, she just got it. Hold on. It's so hard in flag football, like, because at any point you could just grab it and just send it deep. Oh, I think the seniors now take over. We're gonna take another look at. She's just like, boop, twenty-one, got it. Timeout. We're gonna go to a timeout now. The time is actually gonna officially stop. At 528. Gonna go back to that wonderful drone shot shot by Noble today. Thank you, Noble. As now the seniors will take over again, and I would say this game is pretty much out of hand for the juniors. Delay of game. Ooh. Flag! There's a flag on the play. There's a flag on the play. No first down. Everybody's got to make themselves noted. <laughs> Caught! <laughs> she's back! There she's tackled down. Nadia, Patricia, Sophia, for Shayla, Ashley. Shayla. We're gonna take another look at this. Here we go. We're gonna take another look at it. It's gonna be a pass down deep, and it's just gonna be tipped by Marla to put it in the hands beautifully to 23. As now the junior, uh, seniors have the ball for another first down here. Going for a touchdown here. Here we go. Oh, wow, we pulled the entire belt off. I guess, I guess that's one way to pull out a flag. go as you see here she gets the handoff and they're just gonna instead of pulling out the flag she pulls out the entire belt <laughs> I guess that's one way to pull out a flag that is a beautiful sunset no we should keep this shot that's a beautiful sunset in the background Oh, 17 is wide open. Oh, she had 17 wide open in the back of the end zone, but she tried to go for the flat. Now it's second down, and it's going to be short. Do-do-do-do-do-do. Mm. Bump. Here we go. We're on that drone shot again.
Here we go. Oh, it's going to be a pass. It's going to be a pass. Oh, just overthrown. With two minutes remaining in this game. Here we go. 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 Yeah, we're just going to take another look at this beautiful sunset here. Look at this. It's a beautiful night to play some flag football. It's only 64 degrees out, and no sun, no wind. It's just beautiful to play any sport tonight, like we just did the cross later. And now here we go. The seniors, shotgun formation. Inter oh, it was intercepted with one minute and 46 remaining in this final half of play. And the juniors are up 34, 16, as now we're going to take a look at this replay. Look at that. Oh, it's in your hands. How do you drop that? That's 10 push-ups. That's 10 push-ups. My coach would say that's 10 push-ups right there. <laughs> as now the juniors take over with 118 left to go. If I'm the juniors, I try to get one more touchdown just to end on on a positive note. And if I'm the seniors, I just back everyone up. Here we go. There's the deep ball. Oh, she almost caught it. And just, and now they're going to quick, uh, quickly set up. And I will say oh, all the GTs uh, like, yeah. today. <laughs> Mr. Harry like, Farome as our TD and director today. Keith being our slow-mo. And we're going to take another look at this. And here we go. And oh, we're, hang on, we're on another play. The quarterback's got it. She's down the side. And... She stepped out of bounds. 37 seconds left. She's got to set up quickly here. As I was getting back to, I would like to thank all the people in the bus today for doing their jobs. Keith, Harry Frome, Olivia. Olivia's been doing those excellent graphics. Harry Frome is our director today, and Keith is doing you bringing those extra great slow mos today and replays. Noble on the drone, and Rebecca and Taylor as our two camera operators, and of course, me as your commentating today. As now, I would pretty much say, oh, they're going to call a timeout to play one final play. Here we go. Seven seconds left. And hey, hey, how you doing? Oh, I don't know if you guys hold on. Okay. All right, I don't know if you guys heard me. I'd just like to thank everybody in the bus today for doing two wonderful shoots. Once again, Mr. Harry Froome as our TD and director today. Keith as our slow-mo. He's bringing you those replays and slow-mos. Olivia giving you those office graphics today. We have Taylor and Rebecca as our two awesome camera people. And Mr. Noble on the drone. As now, I am commentating today and now Mr. Noble's going to get a couple good shots of the drone for the final play. And they're going to be throwing it super deep for the Hail Mary. And it's almost intercepted, but it's dropped. And that is the game. The seniors win it 34 to 12. Good game, both teams. Seniors deserve this. They did. I wish the. Can the boys go out one more time, maybe? Seniors are going to celebrate a little bit. And um, that's really it. Um, I think we're going to be doing, I don't know if we're doing something, so I'm just going to keep talking. Here we go. Congratulations, seniors. You go out on a win this year. Hopefully the juniors will get their juniors next year in their Powder Puff football game. Fundraisers and school functions one more time. Uh, make sure you get your tickets for the leave of the Adams family. 32 to 12. And night is tomorrow night. Uh, you can get your tickets at uh, jmhstheater.booktix.com. There is also a cheerleading fundraiser. Alrighty, and that was the tonight. game of the we day and the game of the week. This um, is JTV's Bubba Game of the Week, the Power of Puff Bowl. And I'm Steve Ifantis, and we'll see you the next Bubba time. Have a good night.